Hi, this is Adam back from the Rubik's Cubed, and today I have an unboxing from the Cubicle.us. Okay, so let's get right into it. Just rip this open. And I can immediately see my first cube. I'm very excited for this. This is my first MoU cube, the Way Long version 2 Mini. And then I have the Shang Shao 7x7 in white. And it's the Mini. And here is some extra cube stickers and logos. Alright, so that's it in the package. Okay, so let's start with the stickers. So. I got a few logos as well as Half Bright Skew Set. There is a blue, that's a nice blue, white obviously, red, fluorescent green, fluorescent orange, and fluorescent yellow. That looks pretty good to me. This is my first time trying out a Half Bright set at all. I usually like lighter shades like this red and this blue, but I'm trying out the Half Bright so. Um, uh, I'm going to see how my recognition changes with that. Here is just a Diane logo, an extra Diane logo. Here is cubicle logo. And here is just a protective slip. I didn't order this, but um, I know that the MoU cubes uh, come with tape over the logo instead of an actual protective slip. So I'm glad that they include this so I can actually put, actually put a real uh, sticker on top of the logo. Let's start with the Ling Long 7x7. Alright. Obviously, Ling Long means that it's 69.6 millimeters. So this thing is tiny. There it is. White on white here. Here it is out of the package. This is really my first um, good white cube. So first turns, it's pretty stiff and locky. But all the layers seem smooth. Very smooth. And it's very small. Let's do a quick size comparison. Here it is next to a Diane Zanchi. This is a 57mm cube. So as you can see it's significantly bigger, but it's very small compared to the V-Cube 7. So you can see here it's a little bit less than a QB larger than the 7x7. Which is very surprising. This thing is tiny for a 7x7. Seven seven. Alright, so that's that. Overall, movement is a little bit sluggish and it's kind of stiff, but the cube is very smooth. So I'm happy. Yep, so this is the Sheng Shao Ling Long 7x7. Seven seven. This is my first Mo Yu cube. The Way Long version 2 Mini. Here we go. Here's the puzzle. Here's the pamphlet. Very dusty. As I can see here, I was right. This did come with hastily put tape over the logo. As you can see, this is not fitted at all, so it's just laying over all the pieces, which is not good. But here's the logo. Let's do first turns. Alright. Right now it seems pretty sluggish. And looks pretty tight. The cube is very fluid. It 
it's turning very well. And let's take a look at the shades real quickly. This is most similar to the half brights that I have right here. Of course, this is these half brights are uh, skewed half brights, though. So the shades look pretty good. M slices move very well. So let me look inside to see the mechanism. I've never seen a mechanism of this cube in person. Alright, here's an edge. I'm sure anybody who's watching has seen these, these pieces before because they're, this is a very popular cube, but this is personally for me because I've never seen it in person. And here is the inside of the cube. Very cool. That has a blue core in there. The track is very distinct where the cube runs along. You can see it right here on this piece. Okay, so let's review what I got. So in this package, I got this way long version 2 mini 54.6 millimeter I, I think 54.5 definitely smaller than a 57 millimeter puzzle so far it's a little bit tight but it's very fluent and I'm looking forward to see how this performs later on then I had the 69.6 millimeter Ling Long 7x7 Sheng Shao and in white it's one of my few good white puzzles and um, so far it's a little bit sluggish and also tight like the way long but the movement is very good last we have some stickers and and this includes uh, the half bright set for my SKU and a Dian logo and a cubicle logo and this uh, protective covering for the Moe cube. This will go on here. All right, awesome. Reviews on these two cubes will be out very soon once I'm finished modifying them, making them better. Uh, so yeah, stay tuned for that. Thank you for watching.